Well, good morning. So last night, in the dark, we had our friends come over um, who were supposed to be here earlier. Um, when it wasn't dark, it would have made it a little bit easier. But they came over last night to um, swap little pigs with us. So Jaron and Emmy from Ragsdale Ranch, they got we got our pigs from them and uh, I was talking to him the other day about how big my boar is and when I was over there last how little his boar was and his plan was to keep his boar for breeding this year so what I did is I mentioned to him I'm like well what if we use my boar for your breeding um, just maybe because of the genetics are better or whatever because um, mine is so much bigger and then we strike up some kind of deal with the other pigs um, so he he told me he was gonna think about it and he came back with well this is him saying that it's hard to keep boar pigs separate from female pigs is just kind of a pain in the ass so his counter was um, what if I take his boar keep my boar and then he takes uh, my sow and I watch or take care of the two boars he supplies the feed for them year round and then whenever we need to or he needs to breed the sows we come get the boars and we get her done and then in return every year I get a pig so I don't butcher these ones just one that he raises and I was totally down for that so that's what the plan is so I don't have to butcher any pigs. Not that I didn't want to. It'd be I'm gonna learn from Jaren when we butcher those pigs. But now we pretty much just have these guys as pets. And Riken, it's gonna he's pretty happy about that because he didn't want to kill any of the pigs anyways. But as you can see, this is Lincoln. How much bigger he is than Wilbur. That's what Riken and Sully wanted to name him was Wilbur. This is Lincoln, and that's Wilbur, and you can tell that they're different sizes. And they were they were born on the same day. Different moms, but same day. Which is quite crazy. Lincoln, he's rolling in about 250. And that was the other thing I told. <laughs> that was the other thing I told Jaren. I'm like, hey, either you're gonna Either if you want this boar to breed, that's great. Otherwise, I'm gonna butcher him because he's he's big enough to butcher. And uh, based on the size of their pigs, they couldn't believe that my pig was that big, and he is. We measured him last night at about 250, when uh, the little one of theirs is only weighing in. A, at maybe 85 pounds so they're just playing right <laughs> but shit but yeah so that's what we did last night so we had to get our female pig our sow sophia out of this pen which does not have a door so um, even our, even Sophia, our, our female pig is a lot bigger than any of their pigs. And I'm pretty sure it's because I've been feeding them like 15, 15% 15 uh, protein, like pig finisher and corn, just about as much as they can eat. Um, and Jaren said they're feeding their pigs constantly too, so I don't know what the deal is, but... Um, when they got here, I asked him, I'm like, well, what's your plan for, for getting these pigs in and out? 
he told me that he can just pick up his boar and carry him. I was like, oh, you're not, you're not going to do that, that with our pigs. And we tried, he tried, I tried to pick her up and get her squared away um, into the other trailer, but it wasn't happening. So we ended up having to do, well, as I had to take this panel off, we backed the trailer up right here and we had to wrestle her into the trailer. <clears throat> um, but now we got two, two boar pigs that are just gonna be studs for the year. Um, and then when it's time to breed in February, we're gonna bring them over to his ranch and we're gonna breed them. And uh, then we'll butcher pigs after that. Um, otherwise, my weekend this weekend was gonna be getting ready, getting the chain hoist up in the rafters, building a new rocket stove pit to dunk Lincoln uh, to peel all the skin off, or hair off. But now I don't have to do that, which I'm pretty excited too, because that, that was a lot, that would have been a lot of work to do that. Um, so now I just have to feed him, but Jaren's gonna help pay for that. Um, I think it's a win-win for both the both parties. So I well, we just gotta make sure those two get along okay. All right, so that's what was happening last night. But it was a absolute riot last night in the dark trying to wrestle pigs. Wasn't gonna videotape it, but it was just too dark. All right.